Now your first task, of course, in a demonstration or whenever you wake your Mac, is finding the cursor. And El Capitan makes this easier than ever. I just do that little shake we all normally do. And there it is, it comes right out to greet you. It's really handy. Now, we brought other great gestures to the system. I'm just gonna go here and mail. I have a message here from Eddie. Uh, looks like, well now, that's a keeper. So I can actually mark it uh, unread to keep it just by swiping two fingers across the trackpad, just like that. And this one, I'd kinda like to delete, so I'm just gonna swipe it away just like that. So some real nice little gestures. Let's move on now to Safari. Now in Safari, I have some sites that I like to keep around because I refer to them on and off throughout the day. And now, in Safari, I can pin those sites just like this. So there's, I'm gonna pin my Twitter site here. And of course, I've been following the Warriors. Go Warriors, we're gonna get it done. <laughs> just like that. Now, pin sites have a lot of special properties. For one, if I close this window and reopen it, you see that my pin sites are all right there and they load instantly. Now, pin sites also behave differently when I follow links. So I'm just gonna click on one here and you notice it opens in a new tab, but my pin site remains. Now I'm gonna open up a couple of more links. Let's open up this one and let's say this one. I'll take a quick look. This one looks like some kind of presentation video and this one's about the giants. But have you ever had this happen to you? You're like, where is this audio coming from? Well now, with just a tap, you can mute it or find out where it came from and shut it down, just like that. So uh, I'm interested in seeing this, uh, this Giants game and now Spotlight can actually help me out there. So I'm just gonna do a search for the SF Giants and we see right now I get uh, current game scores, upcoming games. Uh, it looks like the game I wanna go to is on Friday so I can just search for weather on Friday. See, we get the weather and uh, can even resize the spotlight panel and move it around. I mean, there's innovation, huh? <laughs> so, but I can also express myself in my own words in spotlight searches now. So I can do things like slides from Brian. You see, I find those there, but how about slides from Brian about El Capitan? You see, I find exactly what I'm looking for in my own words. Now, this works great in other apps as well. Let's try it out in mail. So I've been really busy, of course, the last couple of days, and so I've been getting a little behind on my mail, and I wanna see the messages that uh, I've received from Phil, but that I haven't responded to yet. So I'm just gonna say, uh, mail I ignored from Phil. <laughs> there, there are a few, but I'll, I'll be getting back to them uh, right after the show. <laughs> so, next. Of course, it's great in the Finder as well. So if I wanted to look at documents that I was uh, working on uh, last year at this time, I might say something like, uh, documents I worked on last June. And I find exactly what I'm looking for. So this is really a great way to search. Now next I wanna to turn to window management. So I'm just gonna run a script here that's gonna open up a whole bunch of windows to simulate kind of what my desktop looks like after a day working on OS X because it's a powerful system. And we tend to have a lot of things open. Now OS X provides some great ways to navigate your windows and one of those is mission control. Well now in El Capitan we've made mission control smoother, simpler, and faster than ever. I'm just gonna take three fingers and swipe up on the trackpad you see I get into this gorgeous overview of mission control. I'll just bring forward Safari. Let's do that again and bring up mail. Just like that, works really great. But of course OS X provides great tools also to organize your windows and one of those is full screen. I'm just gonna take this window here, full screen. And I'm gonna reply, looks like there's a uh, message here from Eddie. He says that he, uh, sorry about bailing on the team dinner last night. He was uh, apparently prepping for the keynote. So that's, that's understandable. But it looks like actually I just got a new uh, mail from uh, Jeff here, and now I can just click away, and it hides, and then, oh, hold on, <laughs> busted, Eddie. So I think I'll just drag this actually right into my compose window, it hops right up automatically, and I can do it just like that. It's really great. And I can even open up tabs in compose as well. It's really handy. So this is a great way now to work in full screen in mail. Now we've done something totally new to El Capitan, 
and it's the ability to work really easily on two windows side by side. So I'm just gonna click and hold here on the green button, and you see it's prompting me to pick a side. I'll just drop it in, and you notice I get an expose of all my other windows. Let me pick the new news app, just like that. Of course, I can resize this window to style it just the way I want. How about that blur? Again, innovation. <laughs> so, great way to work. Uh, here I can drag links, for instance, from Safari right in here. And you notice in the new Notes app, I get a beautiful graphical link that gives me a nice thumbnail that helps me identify uh, what, I, what I dragged in there. I'm gonna drag in uh, some yurts. I think yurts, first time mentioned on the w WDC keynote stage, so there you go. We've got some yurts here. So great way to work split screen. But we've also provided a really easy way to move windows into their own desktops. So let me just take this window here. I'm just gonna drag it up past the top of the screen and drop it in just like that, so easy. But I can also do this to take a window full screen. So let's take photos, just drop it in right here. I took it full screen. And now check this out. I'm gonna take messages, drop it on photos, and create a split view, just like that. Totally awesome. And that is a quick look at some improvements to the experience in El Capitan.